Okay guys, I got a couple messages on this. And this is probably my fault. Um, I got a lot of guys saying that they got, some of them got 30 cal moles and they can't get 21 pellets in a three inch hole like I do. That's because I, I use 29 cal. I don't use 30 cal. I, I have 30 cal, don't get me wrong, but I use 29 cal when I'm getting 21 pellets in a three inch number one buckshot round. But don't sweat it. I mean, if you got 30 cal pellets and you're making 30 cal, mine are hot pink. I got 30 cal too. You can still make great loads, guys. This one of them weight come up with. Matter of fact, if any of y'all watched back in the day, he used to use a lot of these Remingtons. <laughs> I get them from the same guy, Mr. Calawas, which I don't think he's had none in a while. So, but I had several thousand of them put up. But I wanted to load a few of these up because I got another buddy whose gun will not take roll crimp rounds. They're just a hair too long. So I have to make him bowl crimp. And his preferred round is not my 29 caliber 21 pellet load. It's the third 18 pellet 30 cal load. And it shoots like a beast in his Benelli. But let's go ahead and make some up. D prime resize the brass. Only problem with the Lee is knocking this darn ring off sometimes when uh, you reprime and resize the brass. See, there it goes already. But all you do is you turn around, give it a couple taps, and knock it right off, folks. I take an old funnel, open up the mouth of these old Remingtons a little bit. Make it where I can get a wad and everything down in there. But it's the same powder charge, guys. 28 and a half long shot. Um, TPS White Lightning Wad. Stick it on down in there. Get it started. Push her down in there, guys. Same thing you've been seeing us doing over and over again. The uh, eighth inch 20 gauge nitro card. Push right on down in the bottom. Snug. 18 pellets, guys, of true 30 cal. They stack in there by twos. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, and 18. They stack up, guys, right to the top of the wad, right there at the very top of the edge. Buffer powder. I had not fold crimp three inch rounds in a while, guys, to be honest with you. It's the first time I fold crimp three inch in a while. I do a lot of two and three quarter on, on the lead load off. I've been, I've been doing so much on this thing lately, my darn mech probably over there roasting. Pre crimp. Final crimp. three inch 18 pellet number one buckshot and guys this thing is killer man i mean it has it does one heck of a pattern but if y'all see what i mean about guys telling you that these little lead load all the junk that's one of the reasons i've been using it so much i want everybody to see man they, they load up rounds beautiful man it's just a touch machine you got to get used to the feel for it yeah, high brass on it can be a pain in the roll by posterior, but it, it still does it. D prime, knock this, D prime right, resize the brass on it. Reprimed it. Usually when I go banging on stuff, I usually have enough common sense to move stuff out of the way. Not tonight. I just take a little funnel, guys. Open the mouth up a little bit. Makes it a little easier to work with. You can do this on any of your three inch Winchester. Any of Another TPS White Lightning. Yeah, this one weighs loads from, I don't know, we've been several years back now. Way before they were using the White Lightnings. 
multi metal is what he used to use back then. Still getting the same performance. Put another 20 gauge nitro card in the bottom of it. 18 pellets once again. Yeah, so don't be don't be worried that you bought 30 cal pellets. These things are killer, man. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, and eighteen. Matter of fact, this is a load I hunted with for years and years. It it was a, you just couldn't beat this load. Traveling up there around thirteen hundred feet a second. Always shoots about it anywhere from a 13 to a 15 inch pattern. Yeah, you, you can't you can't really improve on this one though. This this thing is great. Once again, six point crank guys. Final crank. You see anything wrong with what the lead does? That was a nitro turkey. Well now it's an 18 pellet number one buckshot. Come out absolutely perfect. I could put the guide tool on there and make it a little prettier. It really wouldn't help it none. Open the mouth up a little bit, do a third one, and now I'm just going to shut that off and make him about 25 of them so he's sitting together. D prime. Once again, by twos. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Eighteen pellets. Loads. This load is just as like all the other ones, guys. If you get them white lightning TPS wands, you can't go wrong with them. They're just ideal, man. They throw great patterns, and uh, you just you can't you get long range, short range, basically any kind of range you want out of. And one little crank in there wants to be a pain in my butt. Pellets. So if you bought 30 cal pellets, don't get excited. Just, just use 18 of them instead of 21. It will still throw an awesome pattern. Actually, hit a little bit harder because it's heavier. All right, later.